Hi everyone, so I just want to show you the bug nets that we put on our van. We've, we've had these on, apart from the, the, the front window ones, we've had the side one and the back one on since day one, pretty much. So we recently just got the bug nets for the front doors and we've put them on. So at the bottom they are magnetic and then just goes on the inside around the frame and it goes around the mirror here. And then on the inside, there's a little um, pull tab there. A little pull tab there that you just do to pull that and just tighten that up and then you've got a like a little um strap here that you just tighten don't need to over tighten it and the window's half open up there and they fit pretty good it took, took me i have to admit it took me a little while to work out the correct sides and work it all up because my brain doesn't work very fast these days i have to get kerry's help but that fits nice there's no gaps i can't see anywhere where the bugs can come in and I've got one on the other side of the door, which I've just put on. Um, so we got those from Living in a Bubble. I think they were just over $100. I think so. Yeah, maybe 110 might have been. But they, they seem like very good quality. We don't have anything to do with Living in a Bubble. We're not sponsored. We paid full price for these. Well, I think if you join them, that you get a Yeah, I think discount. if you first go to their website, and I'm not sure if you have to sign up, but you do get, you might get a 5% discount or something like that. I'm not exactly sure. But yeah, so the door ones we're pretty happy with. We've been waiting for those window ones to come out. Yeah, because when we first got the ones for the side, they didn't have these for our particular van. And then we just happened to go on their website a few weeks back and they were on there for our particular model. So that worked out really good. Um, obviously, you take them off while you're driving, but if you're just moving around the campground and stuff, you can just leave them on, no big drama. So then we have the one for our side door which is magnetic on one side and magnetic at the bottom and it's got a magnetic door opening and on this side because of our particular van model and this is for our van this, these screens you have to use double-sided tape and some magnets on that side and that but that works good um, we can use that pretty much all the time this one um, so yeah, so the opening for this is magnetic. Because you're going in and out all the time, you don't want to use a zipper all the time. And on the back one has the zipper. So that's the back one. And then down here is all zipper. And you can open it from the top and the bottom, which is good. Um, it's all magnetic all around the edges on this one. And then magnetic at the bottom. Um, so that way when you zip it down to, and you have it closed and you're in bed and you want to open it, you can open it from the top too. Because we can take this one off and look at the window. This one we've got insulated. But yeah, well, no, we're pretty happy with that. Um, and they're Australian company. Yeah, they? I'm pretty sure they're Australian company. I'm not 100% sure where they are made. Mm -hmm. Maybe made in Australia, but you'd have to check the website for that. I'm not 100% sure. So at... When we first looked at getting nets for the van, we, Kerry was thinking maybe we should just make some up, get some material, do all that from Bunnings or something. Um, but then we thought, well, let's get some good quality ones, ones that we know are going to fit properly, and they, they seem to fit quite good. And yeah, I'm really happy with these door ones. That's, that's um, a really nice fit, fits around the mirror. Um, can, at least we can have the windows open during the day, especially if it's a bit of a warm day and we're not using the air conditioner. We can have the uh, max fan pulling the air through the front windows and have it going through. Yeah, so no mosquitoes carry carry away. Yeah. <laughs> but no, we're pretty happy. So, yeah, the front ones, I think we're about 110 for the two doors. And I think the front and the back, it was probably a couple hundred dollars. Yeah, it depends on your model, what van you've got. Obviously, they do a whole range of um, different vans and stuff too. Um, but yeah, it's called Living in a Bubble. Um, like I said, we're not associated with them. We're just showing people what we use. And that's it. Bye.